A 2013 Gallup poll says that 8 out of 10 Americans are eating at fast food restaurants about once a month and about half of us once a week. We're loving it, right? Well, let's see how much we're loving it after we run down a list of the most disgusting food facts you can dig up. And it's not just all fast food delight. Some of the stuff might be in your pantry. So let's point counterpoint this out. Disgusting food point one, your Cheese Whiz or Velveeta is not exactly cheese. It's more like a cheese product with 51% of that Cheese Whiz being made up of ingredients like emulsifiers and carrageen, that is seaweed extract stabilizer, and flavorings like citric acid for that mm, cheese-like tang. Now, counterpoint, you are buying your cheese in a non-refrigerated grocery aisle. What did you expect? Disgusting food point two, if you live in the US and you eat processed foods, well, you may be munching on a few bugs or or rodent hairs. That's right, the US Food and Drug Administration allows a certain number of critters and their junk to infiltrate processed food. For example, a can of mushrooms is allowed to have up to 19 maggots, and that same portion can acceptably contain up to 74 mites. Counterpoint, insects are chock full of vitamins and protein. Discussing food point three, when you eat a chicken nugget, you may be eating mechanically separated meat. So what we're talking about is blended up meat, no big deal, right? Except that some companies use a method of separating edible meat tissue, including tendons and muscle fiber from the bones, and the whole thing comes out kind of paste-like and is molded into nuggets and baked. Counterpoint, before you drop your bag of Mickey D's into the garbage, take heart that McDonald's is adamant that they don't use this process and they use all white boneless chicken to make their nuggets. Discussing food point four, pink slime or what the USDA calls lean, finely textured beef, LFTB, is still in the meat supply. And some of that supply is used in schools. Now, pink slime is different from mechanically separated meat. Centrifuges are used to separate lean meat from fat. We're talking about scrap meat clinging to the cavity of a cow's gut, for example. The problem is that the meat could contain harmful bacteria. Looking at you, E. coli. So the meat gets treated with ammonia to kill off the bacteria, and the result is called pink slime. And it's found in all sorts of goodies like bologna, hot dogs, salami, pepperoni, and beef jerky, and of course, ground meat. Counterpoint, according to the USDA, the process used to produce LFTB is safe and has been used for a long time. Disgusting food fact five, that delicious glass of grapefruit juice or that perfectly pink peach hue in your yogurt is compliments of a few bugs. That's right, food manufacturers purposely use an insect called Dactylopius coccus costa, which feeds on red cactus berries. These critters are ground up into powder and they're used in processed pink, purple, or red foods. And you'll find them on the ingredient list under the name of cochineal extract or sometimes carmine or carminic acid. Now, counterpoint, that might be one of the more natural additives in your processed food. Hey guys, thanks for watching and make sure to check out part two when we talk about more dastardly food facts. In the meantime, question for you, would you rather eat a diet solely of bugs or something like sauerkraut? If so, check out this video and make sure to leave a comment below. In the meantime, subscribe but the shark gets it.